Hi everyone, um, so my name is Megan, I'm a postdoctoral research fellow in Trinity College Dublin working on the role of myeloid cells in rheumatoid arthritis. So what is this YouTube video about? Basically in lockdown last year I set up a podcast and um, it was kind of a side project. I had just finished my PhD and I needed something to keep me busy. So I decided to set up a weekly podcast um, called Unraveling Science and I suppose the premise of Unraveling Science is each week I interview top Irish researchers to get a sense of the stories that have shaped the science but also the scientists. And so um, to date there has been three seasons of Unraveling Science. I'm currently in my third season and um, we are now sponsored podcast so we're sponsored by the Irish company Biosciences who are now part of Thermo Fisher Scientific and the podcast has really done very well in that it has um, charted regularly in the Irish science podcast charts so people are presumably enjoying it um, and I chatted to Dave, Dr Dave Finley who is the creator of this YouTube channel so he's created this wonderful resource for immunometabolism information and research and we were kind of chatting and we realised that a number of um, podcasts that I have already produced with Unraveling Science have featured leading immunometabolism researchers or researchers who dabble in immunometabolism. And so what we really wanted to do here was have a place where all of those episodes, which are already freely available on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, wherever you get your podcasts, as they say. Um, so really, this is a place where you, where you can go and, you know, pick out maybe some of the episodes that you might be interested in. So I suppose if I quickly just run through some of the guests that I've had on and um, give you a brief uh, overview of the the topics that they discussed in the context of immune metabolism, so you'll get a sense of perhaps episodes you might want to listen to. Um, so straight off the bat, I spoke to Dr. Annie Curtis in my second episode. So she's based in RCSI and she works on circadian rhythm biology, um, inflammation and with immune metabolism in there. So straight after that, I spoke to Dr. Andy Hogan, um, based in NUI Maynooth, and he is hit on his research focused on um, the inflammatory burden in obesity and immunometabolism in that context. So I also had Dr. Sherry Basdeo on, so she works on TB, and so she's looking at um, immunometabolism in the context of um, an infectious disease such as TB. Um, very early on, I spoke to the immunometabolism guru himself, Professor Luke O'Neill, who spoke about a seminal research looking at macrophage immunometabolism, which I'm sure you were all very much aware of, but his episode is there as well if you want to check it out. Um, another brilliant Trinity powerhouse came up in episode eight, which was Professor Clean O'Farley. So she spoke to me about her uh, liver biology research and the function, the metabolic function of natural killer cells in liver metastasis. I had the lovely pleasure of chatting to my PI and supervisor for the last four years, um, Professor Ursula Fearon. And again, this is quite a disease translational kind of focused episode where she spoke about immunometabolism in both stromal and immune cells in the context of the autoimmune disease, rheumatoid arthritis. Dr. Ivana Mills, based over in Harvard, spoke to me about her PhD in immunometabolism and then her postdoc linking immunometabolism with thermogenesis, um, again, based over in Harvard. And then I had um, Dr. Dave Finley, who runs this channel. So Dave chatted to me about his work on nutrients, metabolisms, particularly in the context of natural killer cells and dendritic cells. Um, and thanks to him for, I suppose, coming up with this idea for, for the YouTube video. So um, maybe that could be your first port of call. So, you know, to check out Dave's episode. I also had the pleasure of chatting to uh, Professor Marina Lynch, who works on um, neurodegeneration. So she was speaking about the metabolic function of microglia in Alzheimer's disease. So as you can see there, just from that brief overview, um, there's been about 10 researchers there who have all had very varied research focuses, but the common theme throughout them um, throughout is, is immunometabolism. So it might be really a, a good resource for someone who's interested in learning more about immunometabolism, or maybe for researchers who uh, perhaps want to learn from what someone else has done in the context of an infectious disease or an autoimmune disease or obesity um, or a neurodegenerative disease. And as I said, this podcast is not only aimed at the the research but also you get a really good insight into the stories and the kind 
experiences that, the, that these researchers have um, uh, experienced throughout their, their academic career. So it's a real informal, casual podcast, um, but hopefully um, you guys will enjoy. If I will put the links to all of these episodes um, in the comments below. Um, and if anyone has any suggestions as to who I should interview next and be well assured there are some more amino metabolism experts coming up next. Um, in the coming episodes but if anyone has any suggestions as to who they might like to hear on the podcast feel free to email me up on my email um i'll touch my email below or message me on twitter and um, would love to hear from you all and i hope that you enjoy uh, unraveling amino metabolism and unraveling the world of unraveling science i don't think i could say unraveling anymore in this video but there you go um all right thanks for listening